Mail theft is a growing problem that KPRC2 Investigates has been reporting on for well over a year now, uncovering more and more instances where your mail, your packages, and in some cases your money is being stolen right out of neighborhood cluster mailboxes. The latest rash of mail theft crimes appears to now be happening in the Bay Oak subdivision of Clear Lake. Investigator Bill Spencer is live on Almond Creed Drive, where a cluster of boxes was just hit over the past day or so. Bill, how frustrating trading. It is incredible, Danielle. Over the past year, what has been happening here in the Bay Oaks neighborhood is simply ridiculous. People coming down to their mailboxes in the morning, finding them hanging wide open, and everything inside is stolen. Perfect example is this woman right here, Jerry Knapp. She, a week ago, came down here to get a couple of Christmas presents. She'd ordered online, 50 bucks each. They were both gone, both stolen. And that's just the beginning of the pain being felt here. It's a crime shocking enough, infuriating enough to drive anyone crazy. Postal thieves breaking into clusters of mailboxes all over Texas and stealing your mail. Some do it by buying stolen master keys called arrow keys that can open all of the mailboxes in one entire zip code. We've had so many things stolen out of our mailbox, it's absolutely ridiculous. In fact, all of these homeowners in the Bay Oaks neighborhood say over the past 12 months, since last December, they've had thousands of dollars in online merchandise, checks, and mail stolen right out from underneath them, right out of their boxes. In fact, when we came to this cluster of mailboxes in the Bay Oaks subdivision this morning to do this story, look at this. We found the mailboxes wide open. These are the boxes for more than 40 different residents who live in this area. The Postal Service should be an absolutely essential service that's been around for 100 years, and we should be able to trust it. I went to the post office, I made reports online, I called the postal inspector, and it just seemed like there's a total unwillingness to do anything about it. It isn't just happening here in this neighborhood. Texas is now being called a hotbed for mail theft. As this surveillance video from Katie illustrates, thieves in the night caught on camera burglarizing boxes. Well, this box right here was wide open. Okay. This box right here was wide open. This box right here was wide open. Rather than this just reporting right on this story, today I took immediate side. action, calling the Harris County this Precinct 8 Constable's Office, right who showed up within minutes to begin investigating the crime in this, this neighborhood. Since this uh, past September, we've been investigating this. Uh, we've, we've had several calls for the mailboxes being left open, um, and we have been uh, sending some unmarked units out um, from time to time to uh, canvas the area. To try to catch these guys? Yes, sir. Have you set up any cameras to catch them on video? Not cameras in this location, but we're using unmarked vehicles that are equipped with cameras, and we're trying to uh, intercept them that way. Now, today I contacted the United States Postal Inspection Service, that is the criminal investigation arm of the Postal Service, to ask them what they're going to do about this problem and when. I have yet to receive an answer. I can tell you the Postal Service, however, is installing some 49,000 electronic locks nationwide to try and end problems like this. So far, they've distributed about 6,500 of those electronic locks nationwide. Reporting live, Bill Spencer, KPRC 2 News. Frustrating problem that affects so many residents, Bill. Thank you.